Let's join Yusuf Akogu for business news update. Welcome to business news. I am Yusuf Akogu. BDC operators have rejected the new licensing guidelines issued by the Central Bank of Nigeria. The president of the Association of Bureau Exchange Operators of Nigeria, Aminu Gwadabe, said the requirement is huge. He said capitalization in the UK is £50,000, in Kenya it is $50,000, adding that he does not think the CBN directive reflects global best practices. Gwadabe added that the BDC is not a deposit taker. The Central Bank of Nigeria had in a circular on Wednesday signed by the Director of the Financial Policy and Regulation Department, Haruna Mustafa, mandated all existing Burundi change operators to reapply for new licenses in their preferred category. The CBN noted that the new adjustment aimed to streamline BDC operations and enhance financial accessibility. The federal government says it spent 628.61 billion naira as subsidy on electricity in 2023. The power distribution companies in the same vein collected a total revenue of 1.08 trillion naira during the period. The latest industry data from the Nigeria Electri Electricity Regulatory Commission on Wednesday indicated that the electricity subsidy continued to increase every quarter all through last year. To observe that subsidy on power in the first, second, third, and fourth quarter of 2023 were 36. 0.02 billion era, 125.23 billion era, 204.6 billion era, and 252.76 billion era, respectively. Stock prices dip further on Thursday as more investors take profit. Let's see how it went down this Thursday, leading the losers there. Uh, Transcorp Nigeria PLC down 9.87% to close at 10 naira and 5 copper per share. Sky Aviation ended on a negative side of the market, 9.80% to close at 20 naira and 70 copper per share. FCMB down 9.56% to close at 6 naira and 15 copper per share. Of course, this has dragged down the market uh, downward there by 0.15%. Volume of trade, 360. Uh, 6.453 million volume of shares valued at 7.699 billion naira in the deeds of 7,852 lead exchanges among investors this uh, Thursday. The top trading equities is dominated by the banking sector. The leading that table is UBA, uh, um, uh, top there 48.316 million shares. He traded JITCO 38.534 million shares. Zenith Bank, Nigerian PLC 28.934 million shares as well. Of course, some equities also recorded gains. Uh, leading that table is CI leasing up 9.90% to close at 3 naira and 44 copper per share. Cavitin helicopter 7.69% uh, to close at 1 naira and 40 copper per, se per share there. Champ PLC 7.14% it gained to close at 1 naira and 50 copper per share. Uh, that's the highlight of stock trading as it went down this Thursday on the floor of NGS. Let's see the global stock market and exchange rate data for today. <music> prices increase on Thursday, regaining some of the previous day's losses despite the U.S. Federal Reserve entertaining further tightening of interest rates, a move that could halt oil demand. At the London market, Brent crude sells for $82 per barrel. For the pay basket, price drops to $83 per barrel. As business, I am Yusuf Akogu.